Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Yas. I just got back from vacation and I wanted to share with you guys what I pack in my holiday bag in case you lovers out there are going away on a little Valentine's Day vacation. You feel me? I'm about to tell you exactly what to pack. Now, I literally just got back from the airport and I don't even remember what's in this bag. So, yeah, let's start with the front pocket. In here, I have my boarding pass. Woo, woo, woo. And I have a journal. I always keep one of these handy. And this was the one that I traveled with. I bought one for my aunt, whose favorite color is orange as well. So we have matching journals, but I don't think she knows that. Um, This is a receipt to Starbucks. I don't usually go to Starbucks, but I went and got an orange juice and a sandwich. And the little girl gave me a little bit of attitude. I said I wanted this roasted basil tomato sandwich, and I was like, is it gonna take long? And she was like, no. So I said, okay, cool. But I had gotten a call that my ride was outside. So I was like, um, and I saw her, by the way, minutes later, okay, about to put my thing in the microwave oven or whatever that gadget was. If this was gonna take a long time and you just not putting it in the oven, what? Child said, Miss, can I have my sandwich, please? She said, But it's frozen. I said, Miss, can I have my sandwich, please? You wanna catch your attitude with me? I have places to be. Anyway, my passport. We have medic, okay? I forgot this was even in there. But when at high altitude, you can get dry. Make sure you moisturize. I have a pen. This is like the little packet, the salt packet, the poison packet to keep your bag smelling fresh. I have a straw wrapper. And I have, this looks like the cover to a water bottle of sorts. I wanna say it was on my sparkling water bottle that I got from Smashburger. <laughs> So that's the front pocket. On to the next. So we're going to the big part of the bag now, okay? In here I have presents. These are for, they're, they're alcoholic presents. And they are for someone who watches my videos. So I'm not gonna open them on camera, but that's what's in this bag. Alcohol that you can only find overseas, so I wanted to get that for a special person in my life. Um, This is my Mophie case. It's a charger. It gives you four full charges, and you can charge up to two devices at one time. Amazing! I don't really use it because I am usually asleep. But in my mind, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna get so much done on this eight hour flight. Never happens. Here we have some tissue and a wrapper. A tissue I need. Hmm. I have a knife. This knife is from Cinnabon. I found me a Cinnabon in the airport, honey. I got my life together. Speaking of Cinnabon, be sure to check out my video. Why I'm waiting till marriage. I'll put a link down here or hopefully in the cards up here. Another plastic. I'm assuming the fork was in this part, um, but I don't really use knives, so that's why I still have the knife. Here we have my toilet bag, and it matches the bag. Cute. This set, by the way, is not mine. I honestly don't know whose it is or where it came from. Um, I just saw that it was empty, and I started using it. In here, we have my tooth powder. You guys know about this. It's been in my favorites video on my channel. Here we have some... Rose hip seed oil that is actually leaking in my bag, but you know What can I do now? We have my Aesop deodorant you guys have seen me talk about this in My favorites video as well except this one they came out with a new flavor since I made that video New flavor a new scent since I made that video and so now it's the Aesop Herbal deodorant and yeah, been loving that. Um, here we have my toothbrush and its holder. I know my toothbrush looks very infantile, but that's because 
a dentist in Europe told me that I should be brushing with a small round toothbrush and I was brushing with a small round electrical toothbrush but then it broke and instead of replacing the batteries I just got a new toothbrush and I try to always make sure that it's small and as close to round as possible here is my ColourPop LAX lip mmm what is the name lip stain stick Mm -hmm. It's matte, it's beautiful, it looks great on me. So I've been told <laughs> by your man. No, I'm just kidding. Here we have some panty liners, okay? Because it wasn't really quite time, but you know, always have to keep them panties live. <laughs> we also have some bindies, gotta keep my third eye and my chakra together, okay? So this is, oh, that's it. That's the edge of the bag, it's jewelry. I have two necklaces, they both say Y on it. Can you see that? And then I have a cute little ring. And then I have this. It's supposed to be a bracelet, but it don't fit my wrist. So weird as an anklet. So that's that. Now, the rest of the bag, I have a set of pajamas. These are cute, I just got them from um, Victoria's Secret. Um, I had a gift card, okay, and I balled out. So I got me this top, and it comes with these pants. They're like leggings. So comfortable, I love it. Then I have some, oh, these are kind of wet. Or is it cold? I have some satin pants, which I love. They fit a little, I'm not a fan of like elastic. Like this thick band of elastic I think is kind of cheap, but I really, really like these pants. Then I have some sandals. These are like a dupe or a knockoff of the Zara version, which I'm sure Zara knocked them off as well. Um, and I couldn't get my hands on the Zara version and actually a few days before this trip I did have my hands on the Zara version It was like the last pair in the entire store and it happened to be my size But the line was way too long as you guys know the line is Zara be ridiculous And I did not have time for it on that day Um, so I couldn't get them and I found these at Rainbow They get the job done. I do plan on adding some more like fun to it because I really 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 like the Zara ones and the Zara ones have like tons of fringe and cutesy things so I'll probably be doing an updated like DIY on me soon so stay tuned and then in here is the bras and underwear which I'm not really gonna show you but isn't this bra cute um so yeah there's some bras and some panties. And that's the contents of my bag. Honestly, it was a really short trip, so what I wore there, I wore back. And it was I was in a very hot place, so I kind of just kept my bathing suit on. And when I didn't have my bathing suit on, I was in the bed asleep. So that's in, what's in my travel bag. And I really hope that you come back next week when I get some more sleep and have a decent video up for you guys. I don't know, it might be like, it might be a movie review because I'm gonna go see Fifty Shades of Grey on Valentine's Day, so um, it might it be, it might be something Fifty Shades related. Um, we'll see. So, peace out y'all. See ya later. I needed to unpack anyway, so I'm kind of glad I did this. <laughs>